now we've gone to the number one so I'm going to number one for the second week running Edison Lighthouse and Love Grows <laughs> Presumably, you're marrying without parental consent, right? Yeah. Why did your parents object? Was it your parents who objected? Yes. Why did they object? Because of your age? Yes, I thought I wasn't old enough. Mm. And have either of them come along to the wedding at all? No. Lots of older people will think that at 18, you're perhaps not ready to accept the responsibilities of marriage. What do you feel about that? No, I think it's just a load of rot. Sonny, if you want it, here it is. Come and get it, but you better much as men. Uh, they have to work all the time. Like men can sometimes sit around, can't they? I mean, as you say, there's very few jobs now, really, isn't it, that women can't do? That's so. Some men can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> if you want it, here it is. Come and get it. But you better hurry, come and go in. now that a stop must be put to the bloodshed which is going on as a result of the war. I am also convinced that the suffering of our people must be brought to an immediate end. The so-called rising sun of Biafra is set forever. It will be a great disservice for anyone to continue to use the word Biafra to refer to any part of the east central state of Nigeria. Will the people in Lagos be celebrating today? Oh yeah, we are celebrating what one night here. We have the joy. We dance? We dance. And no, drink? Very yeah, we must have you. We must yeah, have you. Because our, 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 our fathers and mothers have been suffering for the past three years. Even the old men, the old men have suffered for the war. Federal troops behaved badly. 
since they came here? Have they beaten people? Uh, they're seizing of their things. And I beg Seizing of their properties. They seize property? Properties and they're forcing some girls and ladies. They are forcing them. Forcing themselves on girls yes. and ladies. here last year. Um, I'd seen the work, I'd done the work before, and I thought maybe someone who had been out here before might be useful under the circumstances if they needed to get on with the job straight away. I'm just amazed and I find it rather humorous. It seems to me if the police wanted to seize anything, they'd go down to Soho, see smut, see blue movies, and it appears they seized the art only because it was on display in Bond Street, and I think mainly because John Lennon did it. They just don't want him to do what he wants to do. Georgie, Georgie, they called you the film best boy. Georgie, Georgie, they called you the film best boy. smarter to his person than a hippie or a rocker. He looks smarter, his hair always looks cleaner. His appearance is much cleaner, I think. I think it's the way they walk as well, you see. Sort of looks like more walk to go with it. Yeah, I like skin and dressing graces. I like skinny music. I like the way the skin is dressed with boobs and the brightness and looking much smarter. And I was thinking, well, it's only a fashion and the skin is like the way they dress and I sort of my trouble. So lend me your ear while I call you a fool. You were kissed by a witch one night in the wood. And later insisted your feelings were true. The witch's promise was coming, believing he listened while laughing you through.
money is the least thing I'm giving away right now. What I'm giving away is good feeling to mankind. That, like, if you want to do anything, I mean, make, if there are any murderers out there, if you want to stab somebody in the throat, don't stab the person you're stabbing in the throat. Call me and put me in his place. I'll die for you. in the United States. Uh, I, I have not any proof about it, but uh, I can say that uh, uh, some officers in our army and uh, many deputies and uh, many members of the government uh, in Phnom Penh, they want uh, uh, to be your ally in order to have uh, dollars, your dollars. When you Feeling small when tears are in your eyes, I will dry them all. I'm on your side. Oh, when times get Negotiable demand starts pitching bricks and rocks at the student union. Just imagine that they're wearing brown shirts and white sheets and act according.
responsibility to Cambodia, you feel, of any kind, moral or otherwise? As far as the, con the future conduct of the war in Vietnam is concerned, our emphasis and thrust is to protect that flank so that the Vietnamization program can go forward and that Americans can disengage from Vietnam and come home. Well, but in well, fact, we're, we're occupying pieces of Cambodia, and obviously we, we are have not some occupying, uh, Mr. Morton, any part of Cambodia. There's no occupation of Cambodia envisaged or even contemplated. <laughs> Yesterday is just a more dramatic and a more tragic and a more horrible example of the fact uh, that the government will not tolerate uh, dissent, and it would rather kill people uh, than admit it. She resented being called a bum because she disagreed with someone else's opinion. She felt that war in Cambodia was wrong. Is this dissent a crime? Is this a reason for killing her? Have we come to such a state in this country that a young girl has to be shot because she disagrees deeply with the actions of her government? I want something to be done. What I would like to see happen is that my daughter's death and those of the other three children as well as the wounded not be in vain. the internationally understood hymn of protest at the annual feast day of the Catholic Theological College in Amsterdam. These men are theological students, many training to be priests. Three years ago, in black suits and dog collars, they might have taken tea with the principal. Now, like any other students, they sing, dance, and have girlfriends. What do you think your parents and your friends' reactions were if you were to marry a priest? I think it depends on the priest. How do you feel about the idea of, of priests being able to marry? No question at all. It's the question of the priest himself and not of, uh, of, of other people. When I want to, to be a priest and I want to be married and the Pope he wants a priest. He is not married. I don't want to be a priest. Took her home to my place. What she hear me move on her face? She said, "Look, man, what's your game? Are you trying to put me in?" The Queen has asked me to form the next government, and I am indeed proud to accept. To govern is to serve. This government will be at the service of all the people, the whole nation. Our purpose is not to divide, but to unite. And where there are differences, to bring reconciliation, to create one nation.
You've got six months. Uh, well, uh, I'm not quite sure as to my legal position as a member of parliament in prison, how much of my work I can carry on. Uh, I'll do a lot of reading. What is much more important is that I'm going to miss a lot of work that has to be done. What I'd like to say to people is that we have a lot of work to do. If we are, if the people of this country, the working class people, Catholic and Protestant are to survive, we have a fundamental job to do and that job is to destroy the system. Are you a martyr? Yes, yes, yes. 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 Your belly's full of guts more than a hot storm. You look smart as hell. you what you felt about uh, clearing up the, this rubbish? Oh, not too bad. <laughs> Sick. Not at all. It's basically it's a job, wasn't it? What were you saying? Sick. <laughs> Why was that? The uh, smell was atrocious. Yeah. 